Hey guys, this is another Demos Not Reviews, and this is on the McLaren MP4-12C, and this is the white super resistant car from a set called, I don't know what it's called, but I know the product code, C1284. Now this set wasn't announced by Skeletrix, so don't go looking in it, any catalogues for it, and I've only managed to find it on eBay, I haven't managed to find it on anywhere else, and Javlan has a whole bundle of them. He has split quite a few of them up, like because we've only got this car, and there's a really interesting orange one that they've done, and it looks a bit like the same colour as the volcanic red one from the MP4 troll set from by Lewis Hamilton and Jensen Button, but we're talking about this one. So this is super resistant. It's got a sign rinder like most Skeletric cars. It's got a digital plug, which is quite good. And it's got, like the new super resistant cars, it's actually got these detailed headlights. Now you're probably wondering why on earth they put detailed headlights on a car that's super resistant. They started doing it because apparently it costs too much money to keep reprinting them and it's cheaper to manufacture the headlights so they don't have to keep repainting it. And that's also the same for the windscreen. They've made that bit separate so now you can take that out and swap it around for a detailed one. Which, in effect, has sort of had benefits for the customers and also Skeletrix because now they only have to make one mould and also the customers get to make any car they want from super resistant into detail. So, this is actually quite a nice car and it looks very nice in white. And I'm sorry I haven't done very many MP4 12C videos, it's because I don't collect them. But I will be soon because I will be getting a club car, which I still haven't actually managed to do a video on because it got modified before I could do a review on it. And I will be getting the very, very nice Von Ryan Racing MP4, which will have a rear wing and everything and numbers on it. So, <coughs> sorry, again. So, this set contains another MP4, which is also super resistant, but is a volcanic orange, is the colour which is called. And if you see my Crime Patrol set review, then you get the same amount of trackers in that, and it's £100, I believe the set is meant to be. But if you're lucky, you might be able to get it cheaper off um, Jadlan. And if not, if you can't be bothered to get the cars, you can get the cars relatively f fair bargain for about £75, I think. Um, just bear in mind that they are in box because they have not been released individually and they may not even be released individually. Um, so, yeah, that is a very, very. It's a very nice car. I should really show you more. It's got f very, very nice detail. And I love the back part of the car, it's very nice, and it hasn't actually got any lights on the back, which is uh, odd, probably because this is a super resistant version, I haven't actually seen a detailed one yet, one according to the club car box, it says it's got a um, rear lights, I'll have to look at that properly, but that one obviously if you have a look, it doesn't actually have lights on the back of it. And if it's the same as all the other cars, then it will... They'll have to shine through a tiny slot, which I still can't see, really. Anyway, that was a review. Um, please rate, comment and subscribe. I hope you like this car as much as I do. It's very nice. I didn't actually buy this one, though. My dad did. And um, I hope many of you get this car, because say you got some friends that like to race and you get that car you will probably be the only one who has that car amongst your friends because they would probably go to the shop to get their car and not the internet and stuff like that so yeah I like this car and it's got the basic spec of everything else like side rinder and everything and it's digital plug and it's got super resistant so it's a good digital car as well and it only cost about £25 because it's unboxed as well so it's really an all round good bargain car and you're getting a lot of car for your money because they handle very well and that's a point I need to still do the test drive on them as well but they won't cut that 
they won't come out until the Bond racing cars come out, so don't be waiting on them for ages. Okay, thanks for watching. I keep going off topic. Please rate, comment and subscribe, and please check out all my other videos, and look out for the MP4 2012 Club Car Review, which will be coming pretty soon.